These are the joys and sorrows of our community today. Abram says, thank you for this positive service with its positive message. From Marlo, blessings to the Bassett family. Your parents were so loved and their memories will live on in our community. Shoshana, thinking of my father today, the best father I could have asked for. Sharon, joy for the abundance of flowers and growing food that is gracing our community. From David, thinking with love of my dad and my mom too, also sending my love to Bob and Mary's family. I love them both and miss them already. From Ruth, joy for the wonderful service about ancestors and confluence and beautiful music. Joy for the privilege of visiting this cemetery where my husband's ashes are interred, being driven there by Cheryl on this gorgeous day. From Julie, joie pour la fierté qui transpire de ma fille qui a réussi au la main de ses premiers, premiers examens d'école, ayant fait son première à l'école alternative et pour celle de mon garçon qui a commencé hier sa première journée de sa première job. Hopes pour les arbres qui se battent pour faire pousser les fruits qui ont servi au gel de ce, de ce printemps et qui m'amène à la patience et à redéfinir le temps. Un autre jour, une autre, une autre année, love pour tous les humains que je croise comme s'il était ramené la vie partout. From Jude, loving memories of my dad, Brian Morton, right? Janet, much sadness as my soul sister, who is miles away, is transferred to palliative home care, counting the blessings of our forged sisterhood. From Marlo, sadness today as I miss my dad, Peter Turner, who passed away at the young age of 63, defeated by cancer. His incredible music lives on, and I still hear his laughter. Gratitude for my stepdad, Ted Ritchie, for taking me and my little sister under his wings so long ago after my parents' divorce. He is a cancer survivor, musician, joker, and former arch orchardist and custom home builder. He taught me how to find spirituality in nature. From Benjamin, two joys. Everyone in the house got their second vaccines this week and Juliet and Eleanor were able to spend the day with my mom yesterday. That would be in Vermont. And from Kelty Bassett, thank you for loving our parents. I can feel them next to me. Beautiful words and music. Karen is with us in spirit. Please reach out to her. From Holly, I'm so sorry to hear about Bob. He and Mary were the first people who reached out to me when I came to the church several years ago. I was very fond of both of them. I'm also thinking of my sister, Tammy, who lost a dear, very dear friend suddenly, and my dad, Goody, who would have loved this congregation. Reverend Diane, Catherine Eleuthera, Sandra, and Shoshana, enjoy your summer. May you feel much joy in the simple moments. Marlo, grief and rage upon hearing that an SPVM officer was caught kneeling on the neck of a black youth here in Montreal a few days ago. When will it stop? Eleuthera, grateful for the sun, these gentle days warming my heart, for my garden, for life bursting and blooming all around us, for our role as caretakers of this precious earth, for these ruminations on ancestry. What gifts shall we leave future generations? Sharon, Sorrow as I miss my dad who died five years ago. Grateful for him in my life. Glad I was able to help take care of him in his final years. And I miss him so much. From Rob Bassett. Thank you, Diane, for that beautiful tribute to our beloved father. And thank you to the congregation for their love and support. This is a lovely service. From Marlo. Grat gratitude for staff for an incredible year. Rest, rest well this summer. From Hendrik, joy that I am about as immunized against COVID-19 as possible now, and I won't get seriously ill from it. Sorrow that I can still become a carrier and transmit it to others. From Vincent, feeling happy about this wonderful weather for settling into our new space and the way that our neighborhood is coming to life. Sorrow in seeing the video FSP VM agents on the neck of a black youth and the lack of political action on this matter. From Chloe, so grateful to my dad, whose love and dedication for his, 
after his first wife's son gave me an older brother who is now a dad to my kind and creative nephew. From Danny, rejoicing for Juneteenth Day in the USA, sadness for the last femicide in Quebec City, my sincere condolences to the Bassett family and friends. Marlo, gratitude and love to my partner, Robert, for being such an amazing father to Zachary. And Hendrix, sorrow that my children have all moved out and I can no longer take care of them the way I used to. Joy that they are growing their own independence. Meche, my thoughts are with the Bassett siblings today. From Bill, thanks for a thoughtful joy. Thanks for a thoughtful and joyful service. Brilliant to connect with this Father's Day to legacy before and after. Sorrow that I have lost so much connection with my oldest child, who is unable to reach out as my other two children are able. Best to all on this beautiful day. Uh, from Gilles, belle pensée pour mon père Horace. Il est décédé quand je n'avais que huit ans. Mais je garde de précieux souvenirs de tout ce qu'il m'a légué. From Rebecca, thinking of my father, such a range of feelings come up. I'm so grateful for this life he gave me. However, his love was buried deep inside himself. Sadly, I didn't often feel its surface. From Meche, appreciation for all fathers. I light one last candle for those who cannot be with us and for all who carry a joy or a sorrow in the silence of their hearts. May these flames bring you hope and bring you comfort in this season.